Hi, I'm Peter Kelmstrom of Kelmstrom.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I will talk to you about creating multiple SharePoint list items with one click in the application. So this is going to be a bit of a constructed example, but uh, I'm trying to show how it's done. And uh, in the other previous demonstrations about adding new items, they were rather simple, rather short, and uh, not so much code. And of course, Power Apps is designed to be a low code environment. But this use case here, you need to get into some coding. So that's what we're going to be doing here. So first of all, I'm just going to add a new button for this so that we can initiate our batch creation. And that will not open a form, so it will not open a dialog. It will be a batch. Uh, so I'm just going to rename that button. Right that, add new tasks batch. And we're not going to navigate anywhere, we're going to start writing code. So in this case, I'm just going to add five new items. And to do this now, I need to collect into a collection. So I'm going to collect, I'm going to just name my collection right here, new tasks. And into that collection now, which I'm just, you know, identifying by defining it like this, I'm going to create these new items. So and uh, these items are objects, and th these objects will have a title. So these need to be the same names as the, the names in the data source that you're building into. Let's do test six, because we already have test one, two, three, four, five there that I've done before. So now, Let's do that again. Just copy and paste that thing. And of course, I should have put the semicolon at the end. So again, I'm defining my object by the curly brackets, and then I'm giving a key value pair. So if I wanted to add more properties to this, I would just add another comma, and then add another key, that is the list column name, and then the value I want to add to that. So let's try that now. And of course, nothing is being created yet. Now I just have that in a collection. To see that collection, I can go in here under collections and find my new tasks. And there you are. Those are my new tasks. And as you see, they have the property title, uh, all of them. So now to actually add those uh, items into my SharePoint list, I will patch the same thing that as you would do with code if you were adding just one, but this works with a collection also. So I'm going to do patch and uh, tasks to do and then I'm just going to supply that collection the new tasks and that's it there's your code so let's try it if it works new task batch and now something is happening you can see that they've all been created and of course you can go back here in SharePoint and see that they've all been created also all right so uh, in the future, I'll do other demos with a more complex scenario where you want to use that. But in this demo, I just wanted to show you the basic principle of how the syntax works for creating new items. So you create a new collection and you patch it. And that's it. Of course, it would be nice to put a uh, notify message here just to make it slightly nicer. That's outside of the scope of what we were trying to show here. What we did show was just how to create a new batch of items in a SharePoint list. Thank you for watching this demonstration.